Ever find yourself captivated by the latest fashion trend, grooving to a viral dance, or entranced by the most recent social media challenge? Ever wonder why? Today, we plunge into the riveting world of trends, dissecting why we love to hop onto this fast-moving train. Buckle up! It's going to be a thrilling ride. Trends. They're like waves in the ocean of society, rising and crashing, carrying us in their underdough. They reflect our collective tastes, our shared experiences. They're cool, they're fun, they're infectious. But why do we follow them? Could it be the thrill of being a part of something bigger, or something else entirely? Let's find out. Let's start with a simple analogy. Picture a flock of birds flying in unison. Each bird adjusting its flight based on the bird next to it. This is what sociologists call social influence. We humans, much like these birds, adjust our behaviors, our likes, and dislikes based on those around us. For a moment, think back to the ice bucket challenge. When it went viral, it wasn't just about the fun of dumping ice cold water on your head, was it? It was about being part of a collective action, sharing an experience with others, even if they were miles away. But wait, is it just about fitting in, or is there something else at play here? Consider the psychological concept of social proof. It's our tendency to imitate the actions of others in an attempt to reflect correct behavior. It's like when you're at a fancy dinner, unsure of which fork to use, and you discreetly peek at your neighbor. That's social proof in action. When it comes to trends, we see people around us, especially those we admire, following a trend, and we naturally want to follow suit. But does that mean we're just copycats, or is there more to this trend following business? Here's the twist. Following trends isn't just about fitting in. It's also about expressing individuality. Sounds contradictory, right? But consider this. How you adapt a trend, how you put your unique spin on it, can become a statement of your individual style, your personal brand. Ever heard of the bandwagon effect? It's a psychological phenomenon where people do something primarily because other people are doing it. Sound familiar? It's like when everyone in school suddenly starts wearing neon sneakers, and suddenly you feel an inexplicable urge to buy a pair. But are we all just trend zombies, or can we resist the call of the trendy? Resistance to trends is as much a part of the phenomenon as the rush to adopt them. Think of it like a pendulum swinging. As more people jump onto a trend, others begin to swing in the opposite direction, looking for ways to be different. This counter-trend movement often becomes a trend in itself. Oh, the irony. What about the role of social media? Today, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and other platforms amplify trends like never before. With a single click, a new trend can spread globally. It's like lighting a match in a room full of fireworks. And yet, why do some trends fizzle out while others catch on like wildfire? The answer lies in the complex interplay of novelty, shared cultural context, and emotional resonance. Trends that manage to tick all these boxes tend to have a higher chance of going viral. But isn't following trends just harmless fun, or is there a darker side to this collective behavior? Just like a coin, trend following has its flip side too. When we mindlessly follow a trend without understanding its implications, it can lead to negative consequences. From harmful internet challenges to unsustainable fast fashion, trend chasing can sometimes lead us astray. Ready to dive deeper? Let's explore how we can navigate this trend-centric world more mindfully. Just as you wouldn't jump into a pool without checking its depth, don't dive headfirst into every trend. Before you hop onto the trend train, ask yourself why. Are you doing it because it genuinely interests you, aligns with your values, or because everyone else is doing it? The internet and social media are tools. You can use them to follow, create, or even debunk trends. The choice is in your hands. You can be a trendsetter, a trend follower, or a trend debunker. Think of trends as a language. They're a way we communicate with each other, share experiences, and create a shared cultural fabric. They can be fun, meaningful, and even transformative. But it's crucial to remember that while trends may influence us, they don't define us. But what's the final takeaway from this roller coaster ride through the world of trends? To follow or not to follow a trend is not the question. The question is, what do trends mean to us, and why do we follow them? Understanding this can help us make more informed decisions about the trends we choose to embrace and those we decide to let pass. And with that, we come to the end of our journey through the enthralling world of trends. Whether you're a devoted trend follower or a determined trend resistor, remember, you're more than just the trends you follow. Until next time, keep exploring, keep questioning, and remember, trends come and go, but your individuality is forever. Thank you for joining us today. Stay curious, stay unique, and see you in the next wave of viral trends.